But some people said, God damn you, man, I had all these theories and y'all didn't use any of them. <laughs> Why weren't you listening to me on my YouTube videos I made? I, I, I gave y'all some good shit too, man. Y'all making me look stupid now. Come on, man. I told everybody already. <laughs> I told y'all, man. Now we talked about this. I gave y'all some stories. I gave y'all pages. I gave y'all good stuff, and y'all didn't use none of them, man. One Division is that show now where it is so popular. It got so popular that the fan base is annoying. Before we talk about, <laughs> it got it got so popular that they hate it. <laughs> they hate it. Yeah, that's what happens. God, is is that the cycle now? Just nine yep. episodes is all it takes. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yep. No. Yep. Sometimes it takes three. <laughs> If you ain't getting on there, if you're not if you're not giving them what they demand by the third episode, fourth episode, they're like, man, look, all right, you know what, y'all ain't, you're not doing what I want. You're not listening to the fans. You made the mistake of showing me the trailer. When you showed me that, I immediately started writing my own script, <laughs> and you didn't use one page. They're mad because some of those are none of them came true for you, which is stupid, man. You know, you're pissed because the show didn't go the way it wanted you to go? Are you are you wanted it to go? You know, I, I, a lot of people like are getting mad at all people who are doing theories, and I don't think that that's fair because I think this show is built to, around people going in and trying to guess what happened, you know, going in and having fun, yeah, it's trying fun. to predict exactly. things. Yeah. I think it's a lot of fun to do that, man. I think the show is set up on a weekly basis because of that, because they want people to talk about it. And it's a mystery. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it, it, thank you. It is, it's somewhat of a mystery, procedural in some places. Uh, there are things in there where they want people to make up things on purpose. But at the same time, you know, there is nothing wrong with being surprised. People are mad because they're just proven to be wrong. It's fun to be wrong. I love sitting around and talking about theories, and if they don't happen, hey, that's cool because who wants the whole thing to be that predictable? Exactly. I, I've, I've watched people watch something that's predictable. They predict it every step of the way, mm -hmm. but they're enjoying that because mm -hmm. it makes them feel good, makes yeah. them feel yeah, smart. Yeah, it does, exactly. Yeah. You know, if, if you're watching a show just to be right, what, you have money bet on this? <laughs> <laughs> no, they just don't. They, they just were wasting time. <laughs> just wasting time. Yeah, you're like, you got money on this. You know, if, you, if you're watching this just to be right, then you're not really enjoying the show. You're there for bragging rights. You know, and you're there to tell people, I knew it. What did I tell you? I'm going to tell you something. Here's a, here's a theory and here's something predictable. Everybody hates you. <laughs> That's funny how you never see that twist coming. Well, it, it tracks. I kind of <laughs> yeah. I, I hate myself, to be honest. Yeah, I really don't understand the people who just want to watch this just so they can tell people, see, I was right. You should be happy you're wrong because that means you got a show that, didn't, that, that wasn't predictable, caught you off guard, and we were able to enjoy something fresh. That's, that's completely stupid to me, man. People who are mad about this. It's funny because the producers came in saying, "Well, you know what? Y'all gonna be pissed off. Y'all gonna be. Y'all are gonna be. Uh, uh, y'all are gonna be very upset when you find out that half the stuff y'all talking about." And he tried to warn them. <laughs> he tried because he don't want to deal with it. Yeah. yeah. He's like, I don't want to deal with these pricks, man. You know, I'm telling y'all right now, shut the fuck up because half the things y'all talking about, they're not gonna come to fruition. Okay. I'm just warning you. Plus, it's a. You know, we wrote this. Long before you even had any theories about it. So, yeah, it's, it's, it's already yeah, done. Exactly. Yeah. yeah. You know, and even some people, when they heard that, because they said, listen, we're telling you right now, half this stuff you're talking about, we're not playing with y'all, it's not going to happen. And people are like, oh, they're trying to throw us off. Yeah, exactly. That's like, hey, my theory yeah. is that he lied. Because <laughs> I know I'm right. Yeah, but theories are fun. Keep talking about them. I have a great time talking about them. Yeah. I say a lot of crazy things, and I don't care because I just it's just fun to talk about. But I'm not in this to be proven right. I have no ego in this. So, you know, people stop that. Um, you know, uh, and there's also the other group here, man. The, the group that can't take criticism. Not criticism of themselves, but they don't want to hear any, any criticism of this show. You know, they love it so much, and that is fine. You know, I'm not, and I'm not talking about the people who, who, uh, who criticize to hate the show, because there are people out there that do that. Mm -hmm. There are people out there who just want to hate on something because it's popular. Uh, they got in late. Bandwagoning. Ban yeah. 
you know, they 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 want to stand out. Oh, you watching that dumb shit? I've talked to a couple no. of people. I ain't watching that shit. Right, right? Like, right. Well, have you seen one episode? I don't need to watch one episode. It sounds stupid to me. Well, shut the fuck up. <laughs> we know people like that. Well, they, they, <laughs> yes. they, I mean, there's people who will automatically hate something because they feel it's been overhyped. And, yes. and it's like, that has nothing to do with this property. No, those people are annoying. I don't like those people either. If you like something, then you shouldn't be, you shouldn't be ridiculed on that. Uh, or you should definitely not hate something just because. Everybody else likes it just because it makes you feel different. Are you tired of hearing about it or whatever? But, you know, I'm talking about the people who they love the show so much that they don't want anybody to say anything bad about it. And if you do, then they find any kind of way to come in and criticize you. I'm referring to, uh, once again, referring to what happened last week. Last week, Martin and I were talking about this. I don't know, maybe it was you and I. We, we were talking about that scene where young Wanda. Oh. Was watching TV yeah, and we made a joke about it. And I said, you know, and I even said beforehand, I said, listen, this takes nothing away from the show for me. I actually think the show's fine. It's just little things that I don't like, but it doesn't. It's not a deal breaker for me. I said, it, it, you know, if, if anything, it brings attention to something for me. Like last week, we talked about Wanda, little Wanda, smiling and laughing at those sitcoms before they blew her daddy and mama. You know, I was talking about how crazy people sit in front of the TV and look like look at TV like that. I said I don't know anybody who looks at TV like that. I, that doesn't seem believable believable to me. But it's not a big deal because no one else is making a big deal about it themselves. And I have to, I'm going to repeat it one more time. That's when somebody came in and tried to make it a social issue. Why am I laughing at a little girl who's trying to enjoy herself <laughs> in a war torn country with the only thing that brings her joy? And I was like, fuck you, man. You know what? I'll laugh at your stupid ass. I said, it's not real. <laughs> I, I think what it is, and we see this across the board of all sorts of properties that, that we like, but it's that people feel so invested in something that it's almost, it becomes very personal for them, mm -hmm. right? And when someone insults that thing they like so much, they take it personally. Sure. And people, you need to stop that, man. Now, if somebody's coming in and just that they are going overboard and saying, man, you know what? That one little thing, I mean, I, out of nine episodes, that right there, that little thing, man, it's just ruined the whole thing for me. Fuck it. I can't deal with this. That's fine. You, you, I can understand you being irritated with that. But don't come in here and try to make a big deal, especially don't try to compare this to real life issues. I'll tell you what. There are real little girls out there who are starving, who are hurt, who are being violated, and you don't give a fuck. But and, you care about this one fictional and we, thing and here. we don't laugh at most of them. No, no. <laughs> Only ones that look stupid like her. No, no, no. <laughs> That's not funny, man. Yeah, I bet you ain't mad about that. Shit, tonight we're talking about another... Uh, uh, we talking about another Marvel property, and I bet your stupid ass laughed at that. You know, we laughed at this woman being sucked out this place. <laughs> I bet you ain't write no comments about that. Is it just me? Or does, does it irk anybody that Corey laughed at a caring mother dying tragically in a plane crash? No, you don't give a fuck. People dying Shut up. planes you, all the time. It's yeah, horrible. well, you pick and choose what you want. <laughs> yeah. You're, you know, you're also an annoying ass person, man. I, I can't stand you more than I can than uh, than, than the other people.